um, Chinese lockdowns, God, it, it, it's only getting worse in China. It is truly uh, un, un, you know, unimaginable how, how bad it is. Um, there, is a, there is an entire a province, Xi Jinping or something like that, that has been locked down now for months in spite of the so-called loosening up of the zero COVID policy in China. Uh, now you have Beijing on the edge of being uh, quarantined and, and, uh, and locked down. Um, you've got Guangzhou, uh, really the industrial and productive center of China uh, in the south, close to Hong Kong. Uh, they are now uh, being ground to a halt because of COVID restrictions. Uh, you know, the Chinese economy is taking a, a, a massive beating because of this. Uh, the, um, uh, the, you know, the, 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 uh, the Chinese are taking a massive uh, beating as a consequence of this. The economy is taking a beating. Of course, people's lives are being destroyed or being harassed by being forced to be locked down for days, weeks, months on end. Uh, I think the culture in, in, in China is taking a beating. As we said, the economy is taking the beating. Uh, it's going to be interesting politically if uh, Xi and his cronies, how well they survive uh, uh, all the, these COVID shutdowns and how well they do uh, moving into the future. But it does not look good for China. China is a, uh, you know, is a, is a, it, 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 this is a, it's a massive problem, a, a, a massive, um, a, a massive challenge. And of course, they could solve this with uh, vaccination. Uh, they at least could solve the fear of, uh, of, of millions of deaths and, and uh, fear of uh, hospitals. They won't do that because they won't take the, the, the technology without owning the technology. They won't um, actually uh, embrace the, the vaccines unless they get to own the technology and, and Moderna and I think Pfizer are standing up to them and not allowing them to just steal the technology. So they're suffering through this. It's unthinkable. I think one of the interesting things about this, one of the really, really interesting things about this, I do not think, by the way, that the Chinese are doing this on purpose. I do not think the Chinese are doing this in order to control their population. They already had massive controls of the population. They already were monitoring much of what they did. They already had the, the cameras and the social scores and all of that. So this is not about control. This is a massive failure of the, of the Chinese regime. Uh, and, and they know it because it hurts their economy. It hurts their, their ability to project power. It's going to hurt their investment in things like chips. It's going to hurt their military strength. It hurts everything. There's no advantage that the Chinese central government has from these lockdowns. And at least I find it fascinating that, um, uh, I, 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 you know, I find it fascinating that um, so many, uh, I find it fascinating that so many conspiracy theories still exist around covid it doesn't really exist. There was no COVID. COVID isn't a big deal. Or um, that, uh, that COVID was uh, somehow, uh, uh, you know, imposed on us by the Chinese. And yet, who is the biggest sufferer for COVID? By far, the biggest sufferers from COVID are the Chinese. They've had more lockdowns. Their economies have slowed more. They have recovered less. They have lost more GDP. They have lost more. They've, they've fewer deaths. But that has come as a massive cost. If COVID is a scam, if COVID never existed, if COVID is not dangerous, then, the, then you must conclude that the Chinese are absolutely unequivocally stupid. And I, 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 don't, think that's, uh, I don't think that's something one can easily conclude. Thank you for listening or watching the Iran Brook Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Your Own Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.